Hello folks, Scott here with my love from Lizzie March 2020 card kit. We've got a great big 12 by 12 box this month. Let's see what goodies Lizzie has in store for us this month. Of course, everything in your kit is packaged in these Ziploc bags, which are kind of a keeper all on their own. To protect them as they travel, we do get five sheets of 8.5 by 11 inch cardstock. I usually make my card bases from this. We have a soft gray. We have a super smooth white. This is Lizzie's alcohol friendly white cardstock. We have a soft cream, an off white, and a navy. Those are our five colored cardstocks. We also get some specialty cardstocks this month. We have some pearlescent specialty cardstock. We have a gray pearlescent and this oyster pearlescent. Very pretty. Both shine quite nicely. And then we do get some 12 by 12 cut apart sheets. We got three of them. The first of which is this sheet of what appears to be ephemera that you have to cut out yourself. <laughs> great, great, great images. Some compasses, a world, binoculars, very kind of vintage. I love this big heart down here. A clock, there's a number of owls, a moth down here, big moth, a number of flowers, very pretty, some feathers, hinges, and of course our big cut apart sheets are double-sided. So on the back of this, we got this very interesting wood pattern. This is really nice, good cardstock cut apart papers. And then we've got this cut apart sheet of four by three inch cut aparts. Big frames. Very pretty. I like this color palette. Very few pinks. I don't think there's really any pinks on that at all. And on the back side of that, we've got this nice kind of a linen textured pattern paper. And then our third cut apart sheet here has a combination of a four by three cut aparts and three four by four cut aparts. I really like this center one. Fight for yourself. This looks like a ceiling tile. Always look on the bright side of life. <laughs> That's it. Any Monty Python fans out there? <laughs> That's our three 12 by 12 cut apart sheets. Our peel offs this month are a brown mirror straight peel off. Those nice thick peel offs in this nice brown mirror. And then we get this little pack of sentiment stickers. White ones and black ones kind of in a distressed typewriter font. Simple life, just perfect. Months, days, the real life, best dad ever. These sentiment strips are very popular these days. Of course, the months and the days are all very appropriate for planners. These would work great as little sentiment additions on your cards. And then we have this great pack of six by six inch pattern papers. Oh, look at that wood. Lots of wood tones in this kit. Now this is 12 pattern papers, but they are two-sided. So Lizzie has given us two sets of six. So we've got 12 pattern papers. This is the front. And this is the back. This is the, that's actually a, a really nice flower pattern. Not a touch of pink on that. That's the front. Of course, that's the back. This is a nice little map. It actually says Yellowstone down here, so this must be some kind of a map of the big Yellowstone caldera. <laughs> and of course, our third pattern paper is that lovely parquet, kind of a quilt. That's on uh, the back. I don't think I showed us that. That's on the back of our third cut apart sheet. Look at that, boy. Won't that make a marvelous scrapbook page? I love that parquet kind of quilt pattern there. So that's our third piece of pattern paper. And on the back of that are all of these moths. I guess there's some butterflies in there too. Then we have this great text background paper. And 
the back of that is this nice dark blue distress background. And then we've got a smaller version of one of our cut-apart sheets. This is the one with uh, 11 cut-aparts on it. Fight for yourself right there in the middle. That's number five. And the back of that is that great parquet quilt pattern again in wood. And then number six is that other large cut-apart sheet rendered much smaller and the back of that is that great linen texture pattern paper that's 12 pattern papers right there six by six inch pattern papers since we have a double set you don't have to choose between which side you can use both sides as much as you please <laughs> thank you lizzie that's very nice Lizzie is calling this card kit the Moment in Time card kit, and this is the Moment in Time stamp set. It's a nice four by six stamp set. We've got a flying owl over here, a feather silhouette, a detailed feather, a couple of arrows, a dream catcher, lots of mix and match sentiments. We have, you are the best boyfriend, partner, husband, friend, brother, dad ever, to my, I love you just as you are, I wanted to know where the girlfriend, mother, and brother are, <laughs> and wife. <laughs> this is our stamp set. I can't wait to stamp out that owl and see how that stamps, maybe give it some nice color. Our moment in time stamp set. And that brings us to our embellishment bag. Whee! We have a roll of washi tape in our embellishment bag. This looks to be white and blue and brown in a diagonal stripe. I do have fingernails. <laughs> That's nice, very pretty washi tape. We have some Nouveau Shimmer Powder. This is Storm Cloud Shimmer Powder. Now I haven't played with the Nouveau Shimmer Powder. I wonder if this is like the Brusho pigment powders. We'll have to play with that and see instead of Nouveau Drops, we got some Nouveau Shimmer Powder in Storm Cloud. Of course we have our Moment in Time Sequin Pack. This is our sample sequin pack. This has navy and chocolate brown and peach and oyster and some black sequins in there. Well, short of the peach, there's no real pink in there at all. <laughs> we have some wood veneer die cuts. We actually have two packs of wood veneer die cuts. Our first one is this four pack of bird cages, really beautiful bird cages. Oops, looks like one of our birds has escaped. I'm just a bird in a gilded cage. Really <laughs> nice die cuts. <laughs> and our other bag of wood veneer die cuts is this huge bag of alphabet letters. Alphabet letters. There's got to be at least a couple of alphabets. Hopefully there's some extra vowels and stuff in there. I'll try and spread these all out and get a picture of them for my blog post on this unboxing if you'd like to see all of those laid out. We also get a couple of tags this month, uh, craft tags with some white twine in them, a small one and a large one. So our craft tags. And that brings us to our die set. Now this is really a cool die set there. I think there's like 24 dies in this set. Now to start with, we have this great big pocket watch really big pocket watch. This thing has got to be like four inches tall, maybe three and seven eighths. A great big pocket watch. That's the beginning of our dies here. And all of these dies give us all sorts of options. Here's a circle die that fits in the face of that so you can cut a different face. 
Here's a numeral placement, 12 little dashes all across that could be replace your little Roman numerals here. Then we have a bunch of little bitty dies, some of which are hands for your clocks. I think we've got four sets of hands in different styles to use on your clock. Two, four, six, seven. There's number eight. Eight hands, four different styles. And then we also have this little window die. And all of these numbers, we have these little tiny numbers from zero to nine. So if you wanted to put a little date window in the side of your clock here, that would cut it out. The little numbers would fit inside of that. And then last but not least, a couple of other little bitty clock dies as well. You could use these for the, you know, the sweep second hand. Some clocks have more than one face on them. I believe that's like 24 dies. A really cool die set. Now that's everything in our Love From Lizzie March 2020 card kit. I did get some extras this month. I got the Moment in Time Peel-Off Bundle, which includes the Rose Gold Straight Peel-Offs, the Gold Moon Dust Pin Peel-Offs, Ice Blue Sway Peel-Offs, and the Copper Mirror Straight Peel-Offs. Those are selected to go specifically with this kit. I am thrilled to get this. This is a cut and emboss embossing folder. So this is all of these gears and clocks and this cuts out the center part. This cuts out little pieces as well while it is embossing at the same time. Now from what I understand this center piece will pop out. Oh there it goes. That centerpiece will pop out so you can use that embossing folder without the center cut or you can pop that right back in there quite easily and emboss and cut that center part out as well. I don't know if I have any cut and emboss dies. This might be my very first one. That's an add on this month. I'm thrilled I got that one. And then I did get this little extra clock die. This is like a little stopwatch, a little stopwatch die. This is really nice. I like this kit a lot, though there are some flowers in this. I feel like this is a very masculine kit. We should be able to make lots of cards for the men in our life. One of the exciting releases this month is Lizzie is selling that Happy Days stamp set, that big 8 by 12 inch stamp set that had that 6 inch by 6 inch background stamp. That is going on sale. I know that kit sold out, but it, you can now get that stamp set. She also has a couple of ephemera packs and a couple of cardstock bundles to go along with this kit. And of course, lots and lots of add-ons. Thank you so much for joining me today. This kit is available. Lizzie says this is in extremely limited quantities. So if you want to grab one of these kits, I would jump over to lovefromlizzie.com right away. Please use my link in the description down below when you go shopping at Lizzie. It is always greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me today. I hope you join me on this fun, masculine adventure in card making. <laughs> <laughs> Please remember to share this with people who might be interested. Pass this around. I will be announcing our winners for my 5,000 subscriber giveaway come this next weekend. Keep an eye out for my 10 card one kit video featuring this card kit. We'll start working on that just as soon as we possibly can. Thanks so much for joining me here, folks. Happy crafting! <laughs>
For more detailed information, better pictures, and product links, please visit my website at cardcutups.com.